Hi, hi guys. <clears throat> so today we are going to talk about <clears throat> how to create um, different worksheets or how to create a different plan, uh, how to overlap it and all that stuff. Um, so we will get started. And um, as you see here, you will go to Project Browser. It should show up like this. And um, if you click, and as you, see, as you see here on structural plans, there's like different types of levels that you can choose from. Um, and I created these ones. So if you want to create those, those would be super easy. So let's say we want to create um, a duplicate of this specific um, floor plan. And what we'll do is go duplicate view and duplicate with detailing. And it should automatically duplicate the same exact thing that we created. Um, and if you want to uh, change your template or uh, what this, if for example, if you want to put this as an electrical, you can always change it by uh, discipline where it says here. And you can choose electrical, plumbing, or anything like that. And if you scroll down a little bit, <clears throat> Go a little bit down, you'll see view template. <clears throat> so if you click that, you can choose a specific template you want. So the ceilings, um, you can create your own as well. Um, for this one, you can change um, different type of scale. Um, all of them is gonna be different, so you will have to pick a specific time um, scale. And um, for a shortcut, you can do VG or just click on the template thing and you can override any of these things. For example, if you don't want doors, you can just uncheck that. And um, yeah, so that's how you would edit your work, your work plans, worksheets. Um, and to create worksheets, um, you would go collaborate and it says work sets right here. And it will show up like this. So work sets are basically like um, an overdrafting type um, for example, like if you only want a specific cabinet in that specific work set, you could set it to that. Um, you could always create your own new work set and, um, and, or you can rename it and you can do many different things with that. So for example, um, if I want to click on this cabinet, correct, we will go to properties and as you see here, here's the work set. If, you click share levels and details, it will disappear. So I think it's super important to have a different type of layers. Um, and that is how you would create um, your own work sets and worksheets and, um, and hopefully this will help you out. All right, bye.